what are the precautions that the landlord that is the owners of the premises either office or residential who are intending or who have already rented out their premises to foreigners so what are the legal precautions that must be considered before letting out a premises either a rent or or on lease to a foreigner to a foreign national foreign national may be an individual or may be representing a company so in this reference foreign act 1946 especially section 7 and section 14 deals with the preventive measures and the penalty so now the primary thing that the owner that is the landlord must do is to check and authenticate satisfy himself legally that the foreigner so approached him for rent or lease is having a valid visa the second that his passport is valid subsisting third the purpose of this visit whether he has come here for the purpose of education or for the purpose of business or as a tourist so these are all the three precautions that uh, the owner should uh, first take and understand satisfy himself that he said foreigner his visa, his passport and his stay, the reason for his stay. Once these are confirmed, if he has got a valid visa, if he has got a valid passport and if he is uh, giving proper reasons about his uh, tenor of stay and the purpose of stay, then he can let out his premises whether for residential or for office purposes. However, the said uh, rental agreement or lease agreement must be registered. This is the first condition. This rent or lease must have an effect of uh, registration. Second, before entering into a registration, the owner must uh, bring into the intimation, bring into the knowledge of the jurisdictional police officer that he is letting it out for so and so foreigner whose visa and passport is valid and is subsisting. If not police station, he can also inform the landlord, can also inform FRCO officer. Either, either a first officer or the police. The information must be clear in writing. And then the rental agreement can be entered into. And now, during the stay, either as a leaseholder or as a tenant, if the foreigner's visa comes to a lapse, so this the owner must uh, take uh, sufficient precaution. So before the visa is coming to an end, at least a month before, the said foreigner must be served with a written legal notice stating that the said person's visa is coming to an end and therefore he must vacate his premises or make necessary arrangements for extending the visa in order to continue with the lease. This is the primary thing that uh, the owner must do. Not that the first time uh, there is a visa, validity is checked by the owner and then he forgets it, he ignores it. It becomes a serious problem. The Foreigners Act 1946, Section 7, very clearly states, Section 14 gives uh, what is the punitive action. So the owner can be sued by the state for his ignorance, for his willful ignorance, because not knowing the law has no excuse, because of his willful ignorance, in case if the said foreigner has indulged in any illegal activities, 
we have been observing the cases of drug peddling is increasing, especially in cities like metro cities and cosmos cities across India. The drug peddling is increasing, and mostly the the foreigners who are from African countries are indulging in such acts. Several of them are indulging in. They come here either in a student visa or or in employment visa. Or they come as a tourist and uh, illegally they extend this stay and also involve in such illegal activities in such situation. If the said foreigner is caught for some illegal activity of smuggling precious metals or indulging in drug peddling or indulging in any illegal activity, in such situations. The owner will be also held liable for aiding, for abetting the said offence which is conducted, which is actually done by the said foreigner. So he will be booked under uh, section seven, subsection two, and fourteen of uh, Foreign Act, nineteen forty-six. And though there is no specific tenor of punishment that is mentioned in section fourteen. In reference to other uh, IPC sections, the owner who has rented out or leased out his premises illegally without taking legal precautions to a foreign national can be imprisoned up to five years and fine or both. So this is uh, the this is a, this is actually should make. The owners should open up their eyes because such cases are increasing. Therefore, it is better even before letting out, the owner should not only satisfy himself but also he must ensure that all conditions are legally met before letting out his premises. Without which, it is an invitation. In case if there is, if there are two, three foreigners staying in the same accommodation, and if one if there is a fight amongst these foreigners, and if one foreigner is killed, if he is murdered, then just imagine the situation. There are so much of legal hurdles. If there are some drug which is kept uh, in the premises of uh, these foreigners for some reason, either for uh, storing, selling, or uh, illegally possessing such drugs, and such drugs are seized by the police. Even then, the owner will be held liable. So, therefore, the owner must comply with the legal 